All right, so got this today. This is the Panda spin dryer that kind of goes with the Panda actual one, you know, the 110 dryer we got. And, uh, oh gosh, I don't know why I'm trying to do that. My back is kind of bothering me, so I don't want to lift much. You can come closer or back up as you see fit, camera lady. Packaging. Got some kind of, oh loading instructions, okay. button to open it, I think. Maybe you should read the destructions. Right, camera lady? No, that's not helpful. I was trying to lift the whole thing up. It's just the inside one here. More packaging. The destructions. Oh, there's this thing. I guess that goes on the bottom. Maybe. Probably. We'll see. And a little bucket. Babe, yeah. why is there water in this bucket? Mm -hmm. I need a bucket without water. I'm going to put water into it. Stop it. So we got a little bowl to catch the water out of the spout. And then I did glance at the destructions. It makes sense. You're supposed to put the stuff in there, you know, this way, not just dropping it straight in so that it can. That centri centrifugal force and evenly push the water out. Kind of hard with jeans. Shirt. And I probably dare not put much more in there. Socks, undies. Well, dare I? Let's see. Supposed to lock it. Oh, I heard it beep. Starting to go. Definitely not evenly loaded, but not hard to hold on. Oh, and there it goes. Once it gets up to speed, it kind of evens out. Very stable now. Hey, look, we've already got water dripping. Can you see that camera lady? Wow. <laughs> that might speed up the dry time a little bit. That's the whole idea of this thing, is it spins way faster than your washing machine would, even if you have a top uh, front load. Uh, I think our, our front load we just destroyed, um, like 1300 RPM, and this thing is way faster than it's like 30,000 RPM or something like that. I mean, it's, it's really discharging pretty good there, ain't it, camera lady? Is that impressive? How about the noise? Can you guys hear the noise? Doesn't seem too bad. Especially if it doesn't run for very long. This is really gonna like shorten the time in the dryer, or if you're hanging it, which we do both. Really nothing to the setup at all. I guess I could pull the uh, destructions out. Power 300 watts. 
so it doesn't take much power. 3200 RPM is how fast it's spinning right now. It weighs about 25 pounds. Pretty straightforward. It's like watching paint dry or grass grow. You could like fast forward to the end, I guess. Down to a fast drip. There goes a cat. Did you get the Did you get the tail in the video, camera lady? Maybe cat just ran by. Mama, is that, what do you think is, as far as how loud it is? Not bad. Not bad, huh? So yeah, this is a panda made in China. I did look, actually, if they made, you know, other parts of the world made something similar to this. and uh, Didn't have much luck for uh, good reviews. And we have the panda dryer to go with it. The, the little mini dryer, which I have an unboxing video on. We've been using the heck out of it. I love how you move it around, put it in a room. It needs a little bit of heat and humidity, especially since the since we just went through that cold spell. Well, it's still dripping. I wonder if it's on a timer, or if it detects how much moisture it is or something. Of course, if it only takes a couple minutes, it's not like you're babysitting it for long. Down to about what two drips a second, camera lady. What do you think? Three, four. About one inch deep of water in that big wide bowl. Peel this off later. It says do not spin dry shoes, stuffed toys, and other similar items. Basically things that'll make it wobble too much. Do, do not spin dry items with explosives or flammable elements. Wouldn't have thought to spin dry explosives, but you know if there's the warning on there, somebody must have tried it before. Oh, oh. It must have detected that most of the water was drained, maybe? The dog's right over there watching intently, like, what, what is that? Always unplug when not in use. Do not allow children to play in or on this in this appliance. Also would not have thought to do that. Do not open the lid when the inner tub is spinning. Seems like all pretty common sense, except it must not be because they had to put the label on there. And you see it wobble a little more now that it's Really slowing down. You see, it's not pretty good balance there. Too much walking it does. Ooh. Now back over there. Of course, it doesn't take much pressure at all to keep it from doing that. So 
those jeans. What do you bet, camera lady? It's gotta be the jeans. Tub bang in the side there a little bit. So not a well-balanced load, my fault, I'm sure. Didn't seem to stop it though. All right, I wonder if it'll. And it's done spinning. Holy moly! Feel that camera, lady. Doesn't that feel like? Technical difficulties that we had to restart the camera. Wanna try it again, camera lady? Feel the shirt. How, how wet is that? Damp. Just damp, right? Yeah, absolutely. It smells nice. What laundry detergent do we use, babe? Arm and Hammer, something or other? Sometimes Arm and Hammer, sometimes Gain. Gain? <laughs> There's the jeans. And so much less water in them, you can tell already. But yeah, come up close here, about the size of my hand, an inch deep. I don't know how much water that is, <laughs> but pretty good. First try. We'll uh, we'll do a long-term review of this one. Probably, what do you think, Mama? Like a, maybe a month or two, we'll do it again. Okay. See ya.